Hey adventures, let's go with George to school. And we've got a couple new things for you. Enjoy. Oh, hey George. <laughs> I was just about to read a Dora book. Would you like to hear it? <laughs> guess what? Huh? You're in it. <laughs> Ooh, I guess we better get started. Let's go. <laughs> George is going to school today. <coughs> There's so much to do. He chums down all his breakfast with barely time to chew. Packing up a healthy snack, bananas, banana crackers juice, but George trips on his backpack. The snacks are on the loose. The man is here to help. They clean the mess with care. George's new pal, Rami, and his dad will soon be here. Doorbell rings, it's time to go. They walk off toward the school. George can't wait to get there. This day will be so cool. In the class, friends old and new, lots to see and lots to do. Find a cubby, bag a stash, Bunky takes off in a flash. Here kids chat, here kids cheer, teacher checks to see who's here. Look right there, cute brown bear sitting in a tiny chair. Monkey peeps, monkey leaps, into nap time blanket heaps. Our George climbs, soft bell chimes, teacher calls for circle time. Talking, sharing on the rug, side by side, nice and snug. Tell the weather, month, day, week, each child has a turn to speak. Maya signs, Rami sings, puppet bounces on two strings. George jumps up, joins the fun, circle time is almost done. Everyone gets up to dance, bop and jump, slide and prance. George thinks school is really great. What comes next? He cannot wait. Teacher reaches for a book, come sit in the reading nook. Students quiet want to hear all the stories to be shared. Big bad wolf can huff and puff. Billy goats that are quite gruff. Bulls a porch for three bears. Goldilocks sits on their chairs. George just loves the magic bean growing into something green. Finger puppets, what a show. Scarves to make Jack's beanstalk grow. George is chosen, hip hooray, to be the giant in the play. Story time is just the best. Still George wonders what comes next. George loves the schoolyard playground. It's filled with swings and slides. He looks around and wonders, where should he take a ride? He's on the swings with Rami. They kick their feet up high, up and down and to or fro, like they can touch the sky. Jump onto the little bridge, then to the double slide. Rami counts out, one, two, three. They slip down side by side. Over to the sandbox, George digs into the sand. He builds a great big castle. Oh my, it looks so grand. Just then he hears the bell ring. It's time to go inside. George races to the school door, a proud and happy stride. Tables, tables everywhere, just so much to do. Crafts and blocks and science, crayons, markers, glue. Blocks to build tall towers, then a big long wall. George knocks them down right over, smiles as they fall. Science table, so much fun. Water toys and bin. Does this ball sink or float? George will drop it in. Rami's finger painting swirls of red, green, blue. What used to be a rainbow has a monkey footprint too. At the paper table, fold and cut and snip. But when an airplane flies too high, it's George who rescues it. Sit and chat, rest on mat, and then when he is done, tasty snack from his pack, then kids back on the run. Time to go, friend in tow. George wants to come back soon. Leaves a treat, something sweet, a way to say thank you. Knock, knock. Who's there? Olive. Hmm, Olive who? Olive you. Get it, Anna? <laughs> oh, Elsa, you're the sweetest. Mwah!